Hello, you guys. Welcome back to the vlogs. I haven't done one of these in a long time, so that's why I say welcome back. But make sure to like and subscribe. I'm going to be putting out videos every Wednesday from now on out for a while. I'm sorry, you guys. Been a little MIA, but we're back. And we are going on a little road trip vacation slash baby moon, I guess. It's our unofficial official baby moon. Um, we are going to the Elms Resort and Spa, which is outside of Kansas City. And we actually are going there for a wedding. It's like a family friend's wedding. We're just gonna kind of make it a weekend. We're headed there, it is Thursday night, because tomorrow morning we have a financial planning meeting to kick off the baby moon. What better way to, to, than to start the baby's college fund? And then we'll go, I have a massage. Wes is probably gonna golf a little bit. I'm gonna chill by the pool. It's just gonna be a fun little weekend and I can't wait to show you guys the resort. I hear it's super cute. And yeah, bring you along for all the stuff. We started off the trip by having Freddy's for dinner. So that was fun. And we might get another little snack once we get to Kansas City tonight. So I'll see you guys there. Good morning. It's been a while since I vlogged last night um so we got in last night we stayed at like a town place suites by marriott hotel it was not the best one that we've ever stayed at i don't really know if town place suites are a good brand to begin with but a little weird the receptionist was just a little off we we're just getting weird vibes it's probably late at night we also we went to culver's right before that which is like a custard and like food place and I literally got a kid's meal, like a mini concrete and like a side of cheese curds. It was $16. <laughs> Prices are crazy right now. Like maybe that's a normal price, but like crazy. So, you know, it was just, we were just tired. We were ready to get to bed, but the bed was very comfy, right? It was a queen bed though. And also another weird thing, the pillows were literally squares. There was three squares, like they were so small. So it was just an off night, but it's all good. We're good. But anyways, we woke up this morning and we had our financial planning meeting and that went good. And then after that, we went to McLean's Bakery and Market, which is like this really cute bakery coffee shop vibe. Um, I think they actually have a few locations in Kansas City. So we went there, it was really good. I got a latte right here. I got a croissant. Wes got the ham and cheese croissant. He loved it. And then these that I just showed you are some donut holes too, because why not? But we are now officially heading to the Elms, which we told our like financial guy about, and he was like, oh my God, it's so nice. So I'm so excited. I have a massage. Wes says I need a massage ASAP. So it's gonna be a good time. Our room's already ready, so Wes, we're gonna be able to get in. It's, it's gonna be fabulous, so I can't wait to show you. It is rainy vibes right now though, you guys. Ah, but my pool day was supposed to be tomorrow. We're still good. We're still good. So yeah, let's go to the Elms. So it's about like, it's like kind of outside of Kansas City, honestly. So it's about like a 40 minute drive. So let's go. We have arrived. Um, it's kind of hard to like see. Oh, there we go. It's like a sign up there that says the elms, but here it is, cutie. Look at the vibe, ooh, love it, beautiful. Where's my doorman though? Yeah. Okay, we are here. So here is the room. Sorry, we've already situated a little bit, but here's the bed, nice big king bed. I've already got my blanket on here. I've got a nice mirror here though, look at the, the mirror um this looks like just a little closet with a safe i kind of like that though it's like kind of built in with the bed and there's one over there we actually have a pretty good view too this is just the one from the other window is better actually um oh yeah right here we've got the fountain right out front there how pretty how cute um there's a desk here so wes will be working here my coffee and then let me show you the bathroom it's kind of a weird room setup but these are kind of a old hotel oh i thought that was a window it's just frosted glass here is the bathroom the little shower this is the same tile as wes's parents house that's so funny so cute very nice ah it is saturday 
I did a terrible job at vlogging yesterday, but we we went to the spa. It was fabulous. It was really fun. Um, they had like a relaxation room, kind of a grotto, steam, sauna, hot tub room, the massage where you got that. There was a pedicure room, so it was a full-on spa. It was really fun. It was really good, super relaxing, so that was fun. And then for dinner, we went to Ventana downtown, which was kind of Italian, and it was very good. They had like a water festival going on this weekend, um, so it was a little, like there's a lot of people in town for that, I think, but it was still really good. So, Ventana, I also hear the brewery is good downtown, but I think for lunch we might try to do the barbecue place, um, which I will bring you guys along for that. I'm gonna bring you along a little bit more today. And then we did the ghost tour last night, which is $20. I think it's nightly, but it is $20. Well, I feel like it was a little pricey, honestly, if I'm being honest. But it is an hour and it's really cool. You might as well, it's a haunted hotel, so you might as well check out the ghost tour. <laughs> um, so that was last night, then I went to bed. And this morning, Saturday mornings, they have free yoga at nine o'clock. So I did that. We did it in like the gazebo outside. So that was really nice. And now I'm gonna go read by the pool before lunch. So I'm gonna bring you along though and we're gonna check out the hotel a little bit. So let's go. Okay, so I found a spot to read pool. It's a little crowded right now, but I'm in the view of the pool. So the pool is right over here, but this is a beautiful like, it's a patio and kind of a veranda situation but it is gorgeous and these chairs are super comfy. So I'll show you a little bit more here. So there is a gazebo over there, which is actually where the wedding is gonna be tonight. So I'll walk you over there in a little bit. I'll give you a tour of the property. That's what I need to do. I think there's a lot of walking trails around here, which I need to kind of check out. So yeah, but I'm just reading right now. I'm reading a pregnancy book, expecting better. I'm not too far into it, so I'm not, I can't recommend it yet, but it is a highly recommended book. Um, so, Wes is golfing this morning. There's not a golf course at the resort, but um, there is one in the town, and it's, I think it's kind of a renowned golf course. We'll ask him about it in a bit, but um, I got my coffee and my water, so cheers. Just got back from golf, and he is in such a good mood. What was so fun about it? It was just a good course. The, uh, the architect of that golf course built two other U.S. Open courses. Lots of good elevation change, lots of good risk reward golf. It's, okay. Uh, it's a good time. Clubhouse, Clubhouse, Clubhouse was nice. Clubhouse, Beer wow. prices were very reasonable. Oh, okay. Fun. So, fun. Good. good. Glad you had fun. <laughs> I wanted to show you a bit of the hotel. Here's an old safe, and then they have these beautiful marble staircase and hand laid tile from Italy. Love that. Okay, we are going to lunch now. I'm sorry, I just showed you a little sneak peek of it lobby i'll give you a tour here in a bit but we are going to wabash barbecue which is like a four minute walk from the hotel it's literally i mean probably not even it's literally down the street which this town is only like 10,000 people so it's a pretty small town too but wabash i hear is good so we're gonna check it out i'll give you my review afterwards should be good I think that's the smokehouse. This is the restaurant. And then the Alps is just right up here. Okay, so just finished up there. I got the baby back ribs, which literally came off with a fork, which was fabulous. I thought they were good. He got the pulled pork and the brisket. He said the pulled pork was better, but very good. Good little barbecue spot. Um, we are outside of Kansas City, which is a barbecue mecca, so. If you're uh, wanting to do a little barbecue tour, check this place out, I guess. So, we are going to change and hit the pool. It is a toasty one out here today. Okay, I've just been at the pool. I'll show you. It's popping, but we are gonna go through the lap pool, so I'll take you there and I'll show you the fitness center too. Okay, so over here is the fitness center. It's actually pretty decent and there is a Peloton in there. But we are going to the lap pool, which is haunted. Stay tuned. So this is the lap pool. It's actually a European lap pool. 
I don't know why, but it is. So we're gonna get in, and then there's some chairs now. It is in the basement, so it's like not, like you're not getting sunshine, but it's very calm down here. So, it's relaxing. Okay, I'm gonna go take a dip. I'll see you later. Okay, got ready for the wedding. So here, mom and dad, <laughs> cuties. This dress is Rent the Runway. Ooh, what's the brand? Can you look at the brand in case anyone wants to know? Amelia George. Amelia George. It's a little scandalous. No free nip, <laughs> nipple things. Um, but yeah, this is what we're wearing. Um, I'm wearing these shoes. And yeah, I'll take some clips on my phone. But um, the wedding is in the gazebo here on the property. And then the reception is in, I think there's a few reception rooms. This one is the one kind of right off the pool. It's I would say kind of a smaller reception room. Like I prob probably like 100 to maybe 150 people size, maybe even less, but that's where we're at. I think there are bigger ones in case you're curious. There was a lot of people looking at the venue today. So I think it's a popular wedding venue in case we got any brides out there. <sighs> okay, let's go. Hello, you're checking out. I'm just standing out front here. This is the front. Um, I will chat more about it later, but we're leaving right now. Alrighty, folks. Editor-in-chief here, Mr. Goforth. So Jacqueline forgot to film an outro for that video, but I just talked to her and she said the stay was awesome. She had a lot of fun. She would highly recommend it for everybody. There really wasn't any bad parts about our stay. So if you're looking for kind of a unique experience outside of the Kansas City area, we would highly suggest the Elms. Thanks for watching and uh, check in next Wednesday for our next video. Toodles.